Okay, so this little trick right here is in reference to a guy that I learned this from. His channel was called Gap Recording Namibia. So you might want to check that out if you want. Other than that, um, I'm going to explain to you how to override your controller in case you have display issues. So let's get into this. What's going on, everybody? This is the Batman of Inglewood signing in. And before we even get into this video, please, if you can, just go ahead and subscribe, give a like, and leave me some comments. Okay, let's get into it. So, what's cool about this is um, this video is about how you can override your display in case you're, like, stuck on a road somewhere. Hopefully, you have a blade or something like that. But um, if anything, hopefully nothing like this ever happens. But if it does, at least you can get yourself home. And that's it and that's that. So, okay. So right now this is the TFT color display. Um, I'm going to get to that in a moment. Um, and this right here is the SW900 display. So there's nothing wrong with this one right here. But what I did was cut off the cut off this piece off the other color control display because that one stopped working so I was able to at least salvage this piece off right here so the thing is this would be the male piece of that uh, display that you cut off anyways uh, what happens is from the controller you need to short out the blue wire and the red wire. So in this case, all you have to do is remember, if you ever have this problem, think Republican and Democrat. Okay? Think bipartisan. And you cut this wire, you take, uh, you, you would cut this wire right here apart or whatnot. And then you would put together the red wire and the blue wire not the red and black do not do that that is a absolute mistake you fry something but you take the red and the blue bipartisan republican and democrat and you put them together but to avoid all having to cut this wire right here from your controller what you do is you have always keep with you if you can, if you can, because you you can actually order this from Amazon, okay. So what you do is you take the blue and red from here, right, and then you go ahead and short them out on this point, because from the male end, if it's shorted out, once you stick that into the female, it'll short it out without you having to cut this to short it out. You see, so you always want to keep something like this with you. And if you don't have this with you, of course, then you might have to cut this at least to get yourself home. So I just wanted to let you guys know that for anyone out here who's having a, um, display issues, you can go ahead. If you get a replacement, cut the other piece off of the other one or just order this from Amazon and then make it yourself and just short out the red and blue. That way, when your display starts acting up, you can just plug this up, override. Your controller will be on. The only thing is you would still need your key and whatnot to turn the controller on. But at least it'll still work. So, anyways, uh, Batman of Inglewood signing out.